As many of you may be aware, the Seymour Competition M26 shotgun is a Category A shotgun. The Victoria Police have written to owners of the M26 in Victoria, advising them of their intention to consider reclassifying it from a Category A to Category D firearm. So what that would mean is that the owners will either have to dispose of them, or if they're allowed to keep them, they certainly wouldn't be able to sell them, and you would no longer be able to buy that shotgun. Reclassification is a bad law. It's actually a loophole in the National Firearms Agreement that allows bureaucrats to move firearms from one category to another, putting them out of reach of shooters. So the National Shooting Council has done quite a bit of work on this. We've been delving into the patent and the history of the, of the gun. Now, Victoria Police are arguing that the military firearm that they're comparing the civilian M26 with is in fact the military version of the M26. So you've got two here, the civilian and the military M26 but they're really only common in name only because the military M26 is an under-barrel attachment to a rifle such as an M4. So the military can have a two-in-one gun that is a rifle barrel on the top and a shotgun barrel underneath. Two triggers, two magazines. That's not the case with the civilian M26. The civilian M26 is just a shotgun by itself. So we'll be fighting this on the basis that the civilian M26 is not duplicating the military version either in appearance, design or function. We need to win this because reclassification is a very slippery slope. So far we've seen firearms recategorized simply because they appear to be something that they're not. So if you're interested in following this and fighting reclassification, then follow the National Shooting Council either by following us on Facebook or by joining our email list at nationalshooting.org.au because we need to win this fight.